जनरल फिजिकल एग्जामिनेशन इज नोन एज जनरल फिजिकल एग्जामिनेशन बिकॉज जनरली यू आर असेसिंग ईच एंड एवरी सिस्टम ऑफ योर बॉडी फॉर एग्जाम्पल वेन यू आर चेकिंग द रेस्पेक्ट रेट दैट मीन्स यू आर गिविंग लुक टू दी रेस्पेक्ट सिस्टम वेन यू आर चेकिंग द ब्लड प्रेशर ऑन द पल्स दैट मीन्स यू आर गिविंग लुक टू दी कार्डोवेस्कुलर सिस्टम इन दिस वे वॉट एवर द कम्पोनेंट्स यू आर चेकिंग इन द जनरल फिजिकल एग्जामिनेशन दे आर एक्चुअली गिविंग क्लू to you about every system for example when you are checking the anemia that means you are checking the hematological system of your body whenever you are checking the uh, jaundice that means you are giving a look to the liver in this way you are touching each and every system so general physical examination is divided into two components one is the vital and other one is the non vital in the vitals you have to check the blood pressure you have to check the pulse you have to check the respiratory rate and you have to check the Temperature. temperature these are the four things now in other one is also included and that is the pulse oximeter which is also considered as the vital mm. and it is especially more uh, practical or practical practicable uh, in after the era of uh, covid okay. so this is the vital component and other one is the non vital component non vital component starts from the hands in which you see the splendor hemorrhage you see the color being you give uh, touch to the rheumatological system by the as you was doing uh, by the use. joints I'm and nodules and after that you will go up you will see the texture of the hair in order to see uh, give touch to the dermatological system of the body jaundice anemia cyanosis and after that you will go down and in the neck you will see the uh, jvd and the thyroid gland and also the left nodes now you will go down and in the feet you will see again the coloring and the cyanosis have you studied differential cyanosis and differential coloring mm -hmm. you must study and uh, uh, after that you will give the uh, touch to the uh, left nodes then you will feel the pain in this way uh, the general physical examination is done but every examination every examination is done with three p permission position and proper exposure you have to introduce yourself to the patient that i am dr arshad ali but i would like to do such examination on you with your permission during that if you feel discomfort please let me know permission position and proper exposure as the video is being as the video will be recorded on this patient therefore we are not going to properly expose this patient otherwise proper exposure must be done you did not tell me about the proper exposure at least you should tell me that i would like to do the proper exposure of this patient then after the whether the examiner is allowing you or not so i am now starting assalamu alaikum mera naam dr arshad ali aapka naam kya hai labnawaz main aapka muayena karunga koshish karunga ki aap kam se kam tak dikhe theek hai aap let jaye mere liye I'm, I'm not properly exposing this patient because of the privacy. And after having this, then I will go to the bed end and will give general look to the patient like this. Very very sensitive. And after this, also you have to give look to the bed end side because this will also give you some clue. Like and you have to act like this. Examination nothing but it is acting. You have to act like this. Is something there that gives you clue? Around the bed, for example, asthmatic patient is there. Then most of the time you will have to present. You have to get through like this. And now I will start my way of starting the general physical examination is to go into the vitals. Because if you are missing the non-vital, that is okay. But if you are missing the vital, the examiner will not pass it. So my way of starting the general physical examination is to go into the vitals. For example, let's consider this is the thermometer, and uh, before uh, putting the thermometer in the axilla of the patient, you have to get the notice of the examiner, or you have to get the uh, attention of the examiner that see I am bringing the uh, mercury on the baseline. You have to do like this, and after that, कहाँ पे दर्द तो नहीं है आपने? ठीक है, कि मैं यहाँ पे रख दिया, ठीक है? उसके बाद I'm going to take the pulse, and if the pulse is regular, then just count it for the 15 seconds and multiply it with the four. But if you find it irregular, then you have to count it for one minute. 
So pulse. And there is no need of uh, counting the radiofemoral. Uh, radio it is usually done whenever you are uh, asked, when you are asked to the pulse exhibition. Otherwise, the radial pulse is sufficient. If you are unable to have it on this side, then you may have uh, on it. So for example, uh, you have to check like this, and there should be the watch for 15 seconds. Okay, pulse is counted. Now, the respect rate. The respect rate can be counted in, it is the uh, voluntary uh, process. So, patient may increase itself or patient may decrease itself. Just to divert the mind of the patient, you can even put the something on the abdomen and see the movement of that thing. Or you can divert the mind of the patient by putting your hand again on the pulse and keep on looking at the movement of the abdomen. In this way, you can also have the clue of respect rate. So this is my method of uh, examining the respect rate because I find it ridiculous to put something on the uh, abdomen and see the movement of that thing. Then blood pressure. Blood pressure should be taken. The arm should be at the level of the arm, uh, heart. And the cuff should be applied on the arm, two fingers above the brachial artery. First, the palpatory method is done. Why it is done? Oscar method is not done first. First, the palpatory method is done because whatever the reading that you obtain on the palpatory method, then only up to 10 to 20 millimeter mercury you will go beyond that on the oscillatory method. So, like this. Again, feel the brachial artery here. Then put the diaphragm over the brachial artery. And whatever the reading that you obtained on the pulpitary method, go up to 20 millimeter or 15 millimeter of mercury beyond there. So I was having 110. Now I will go only up to 130 or 125. The pulpitary method only you can have the reading of a systolic blood pressure, but on the oscillatory you can have the reading of both systolic and diastolic. Now the vital components are completed, and after that I will check the. Don't forget to take it out, and again get uh, the attention of the examiner, realizing that you are checking this. Again get it on the baseline, then put it. Now the non-vitals. Non-vital starts from the hands. Up this side, up this side. I am actually ruling out the tremors. See, I am ruling out the tremors. Okay. And after that, you must see the coloring in this patient. Don't put the card directly because there are the stages of the coloring. If you are able to obtain the fluctuation, fluctuation is the first stage. Then after you can go for the card test. And car test, if car test is positive, then you can go for the chevron plan. Mm -hmm. But if you are not having the fluctuation, then what is the need of going for the car test? For, for, second, for second degree, you have to be in the first degree. You don't need to put the car directly. Yes, if you are suspecting uh, there is the color being in this finger, then first confirm that with the fluctuation and after that go for the car test. So uh, first of all, I have to give general look in this way. Okay. And after that, the coloring. And the method of coloring to check the uh, method to uh, check the coloring is stabilize the distal interfilarial joint. The coloring in which you are suspecting, not in each and every finger. Don't waste your time. Stabilize the distal interfilarial joint and apply pressure from here. So what, uh, why a fluctuation happens, there is a, uh, this is actually the neovascularization. So if I apply uh, pressure from here, the blood will be shifted to this side and I will keep on feeling it. And then I will apply pressure from here and it will be shifted to this side, then I will feel it. 
If I'm able to pick the fluctuation, then go for the test. If there's no fluctuation, don't waste your time over the car test. Or don't waste your time over the shimosan. I have seen many students, whenever they are asked uh, to perform the uh, academic examination, they all dieted to the brain. Obviously, the food can This is not a way. Uske baad aap nodules dekh lehen. Paul mein rai di mea. Sorry. Yes, Paul mein rai di mea. Interpreter, contracture, hypothenar muscle, atrophy. Hypothenar muscle, atrophy. Thik hai? Same in this way, in this hand. He seems to be very over the top. Oh, God, I'm pushing him. What are you doing? I'm pushing him. Without all this. Okay. After that, you do it like this. From a time, no deals. This is your finding also. You have to tell the examiner this finding as well. Uske baan now go to the head. Right. You go take care of the hair. There will be the yellow fish on the essay part. Then you must take the ear cavity. Ear cavity. And after that, the hydration. ठीक है? Then anemia. आप ऊपर देखें। This is the way of checking the anemia. Summer tension is not like this. Not like this. Then जाने साथ नीचे देखें। नीचे देखें। Like this. ठीक है? Then nasal cavity and oral cavity. मुख लें। There must be touch in your hand. And to see the oral cavity, the oral cavity, you what you will see? The health of the tongue. Microglasia can give you the glue of the amyloidosis cells and the hygiene of the teeth. For example, in the patient of system, excuse the patient will not able to open the mouth and there will be the poor hygiene of the oral cavity. Okay? Uske baal, ab darik niche aajay. Darik niche aajay or look at the coloring of the toes as well. And then, hitting edema. All the major pillars. If there is pitting edema, you will extend your examination up to the level where you can have the pitting edema. ठीक है? यहाँ पर ही ऊपर आ जाएँ आप। अपना सर ऊपर करें। मुझे निकल के दिखाएँ। सारे एंड के लिए। ठीक है? सारे एंड के लिए इस एग्जामिन एंटीरली एस वेल एस लेटरली। तो यहाँ पे आप आ गए। निकल के दिखाएँ मुझे। निकल के दिखाएं निकल के ठीक है इफ देयर इस एविडेंस आप थायराइड ग्रेंड एब्नॉर्मलिटी देन यू विल एक्सटेंड योर एग्जामिनेशन नाउ योर एग्जामिनेशन नॉट लिमिटेड अप टू जस्ट फॉर्मलिटी ठीक है नाउ द पेशेंट वुड हैव बी 45 डिग्री ऑफ एंगल just see the lateral effect of the neck. If you are finding something abnormal in the form of raised JVP, then you will confirm it with the foot uh, space. Otherwise, there is no need of it. But at least you can uh, do the hepatic liver reflex. Yahan pe dal to nahi aapne? Thik hai, main yahan pe zor laga hai. Thik hai, yahan zor dunga. See, there is no raised JVP. To which thing you are measuring? When there is no raised JVP, there is no need of measuring it. Thik hai? Now, the uh, lymphadenopathy. Mm -hmm. Lymphadenopathy, very easy way. Main body better than just to illustrate you. I am just illustrating you. I am just illustrating you. Don't examine the both sides are sensitive because some patients are a carotid hypersensation and they may go in the sense of these. So the method is like this. One hand should be here and it should be tilted on the opposite side in order to have the prominence of this side of the lymph nodes. And feel like this.
ठीक है देन सेम इन द साइड आई एम जस्ट जस्ट कटिंग देम देन पोस्टर एक्सिलरी देन एंटीरियर आर्किलर पोस्टर आर्किलर एंड पोस्टर आर्किलर ठीक है नाउ द नेक इज कंप्लीटेड आफ्टर दैट नाउ आई एम डूइंग ना आई हैव जस्ट कंप्लीटेड द नेक ठीक है नाउ आई एम डूइंग देयर सो इफ द पेशेंट इज फीमेल you cannot put the arm of a patient a female patient on you if they would be somewhat ridiculous and awkward so you uh, if the patient female ask the patient to do like this to so, apne hand ye aise fit karna hai poste aise karna hai but before you are going to touch the area you have to tell the patient that i am going to touch this area main yahan half lagaunga theek hai apne pareshan nahi hona ye maine half lagaya yahan pe this is anterior group of the lymph node this is posterior group of the lymph node this is lateral and this is central and the if, if i insert my finger this is a pica so five group of lymph nodes are there theek hai lateral group is a check day with same hand same. only the lateral group theek hai so this is anterior anterior see how i am feeling and then posterior and then medial now a pica सही है, जेन इपी ट्रोपिकल, अगेन नॉर्मल, सेम सेम यहाँ पे आल्बर, एंटीरर, स्टेयर, लेटरल ओगेन, ठीक है ये भी ये भी, उसके बाद इपी ट्रोपिकल, वैसे क्या? इस शर्किंग ऑफ शोल्डर्स के ऊपर, ठीक है सुपर कंट्रोल को भी होगा, आप इसे क्या लेंगे? मैं यहाँ पे आप लगाऊंगा so there is a superficial chain and there is a vertical chain so put the your both hands simultaneously because this is some of the private area don't uh, give more time to the patient uh, by applying uh, by checking one side then the next side ye yahan pe aap dekho then repeat the pin now oh sorry copy it copy it then in the end you have to say thank you to the patient mehrbani rabnawaz thank you well i'll i'll and in the last you have to get your hands again sanitize okay na jo ali ma mein na the bigar so mai na the mosi sar ke mari so this was a actually the physical exam so if the patient is male